SS with special shock absorbing system or something. It's trailing link and anti-dive system. Put this on a macro lens on the Honda car at the moment. Just arrived in Narita City after having to call JAF to get the car started. I'm going to take a shot of Narita San in a moment outside of the car, which is the temple and shrines complex in the city. There must be a hundred shrines here, beautiful shopping center area. Some of the shrine area, Narita San. Colorful stalls and booths. map board of all the temples or some of the temples in this area. We're looking at this one right here, coming down the street right in front of it, but here is a view of some of the temples. Around Beautiful pond-like setting covered by vines, grape vines of some sort. Very beautiful. What does that say, Jennifer? Can you read that, Mark? The writing on there? Right in front of the shrine, on the shrine grounds, the temple grounds, are the shops selling all the trinkets and good luck charms and driver's charms, all kinds of trinkets and blessed items. Three million people come here on New Year's festivals for uh, blessings. Buses coming down this narrow, narrow street, maneuvering there. Still right in front of the shrine. Cars in back of me. I'm gonna leave right now and go get Polka. And the kitties! Look at those buses go. Oh, it's a whole group of buses. Wow. The top of the shrine that I said I'd stop and shoot at, I couldn't get around to the front of it with parking, you have to walk. Tokyo. And here's the Toyota van. Who says the signs are mill well marked? Here's the sign to Narita City in the airport. You see about one of those signs every uh, every 20 miles, it seems. This is typically what you see. There's the light and there's the signs. And if you read Japanese, you're all set. Here, not sure this is going to work. I'm driving the car and taking movies at the same time. up for security check. It started about three or four miles back to get to this point. Even empty buses come through here. There's nobody on those buses at this point. Police are looking in the trucks, looking in the bottoms. Very tight security today. Checking IDs. Brutal looking guys. Tough looking guys.
Okay, ladies and gentlemen, here he is, Mark Daniel Frank, eight years old, going to be nine years old pretty soon, and he's going to show you some of his weapons. He's got his combat gear on, all the way from his combat I shoes got, to I pants. Got, I have more weapons. Okay, describe these weapons you have in your hand to me. What is that weapon right this there? One? Yeah. It's a pistol. What kind of pistol? Is Wait, it a, it's a P-38. P-38, German Luger, okay. Yeah. And what is the other, where's your combat rifle thing? This is an Uzi 5. Made by whom? Who makes the Uzi? Sek, Sek Eden. Sek Eden. Is that from Israel? No, it's from Japan. Okay, stand up here and let's take a look at you now. And what is that thing you have across your chest? What's this, that? Yeah. These are um, extra bullets. Do they go in your gun? Yeah, they go in. This part in my back goes for this gun because I, I usually don't use this gun. Yeah. And the, all these go in this one. Okay, looks good, man. Let's go in the kitchen and take a look at the mom, okay? okay. What cereal are you eating, Jennifer? Mud. Mud. <laughs> who, <may? laughs> who makes the mud up for you? Mud. Did you take my 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 tea chest? Uh, I don't think so. I don't think it was in here. It was a tea chest down there. Put on, yeah, I have here this other rifle. It's a rifle. Made by whom? What is that? Army. Is it a Springfield? Doesn't say. Are you Peter? Wait. No, that's a Winchester. It says made in Hong Kong. <laughs> okay. This is a with a really long line. And it says Arco. Arco, okay. And it was an M, it say Marco. Yeah, Marco Frank. Look. Uh oh, one, that's a cap pistol. This one, the Rich Ray Special. Let's see. Both of you look great. Look at those big blue eyes. I'm not going to shoot your body because you're not dressed. I'm just shooting your head. Don't. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Jennifer's Father's flying. 15th this is, birthday. This is number, number, number big four oh. five zero. Guys, can you believe it's 50 years? Michael. And here's Michael. There's Michael and there's Mark. That is what you do every day. Here is, ladies and gentlemen, pouring the coffee. This is the toughest job in the morning. Yeah, this is my morning job. And the older you get, the, the worse it gets. <laughs> I'll hold the candle for you, Dad. Where? Oh, that one candle? That's yeah. my, my favorite amount. Dad, don't touch him. Where did Mike go? Uh, he went, uh, I think Mike, he went to enter my room. Are you shooting all this time? Dad, happy birthday to you. Well, I was not going to put 50 candles on you. Oh, look at this. Look what I have here. Put here it on your neck. Put this around my neck. Put it around both our necks. But don't pull it because it can cut. Happy birthday to us. We have to wait. Okay, let me get Mark. I can't even do what I want with my own birthday cake. No, you can't. <laughs> you can only eat it. You can't have Ooh, it. You can't like have it eat it all the time. You can't have your cake and eat it. And eat it. No, you okay, always want to do this. This is the story of the last 25 years of yours. Yeah. But you can't do this, kiddo. You have to change Is this now. breakfast for everybody? This is breakfast for you because I know you would eat it for breakfast, right? Right. You got it. Unless you want to have your fried little cereal. <laughs> <laughs> You've got to sing. Mm. Come on, Mark and Jennifer and Michael. Honey, Michael can't have cake. He's on a diet. Okay. Happy birthday, why, don't we, Daddy. why don't we sit down and sing happy birthday? 